A Michai Eliyahu's pronouncement that uh, Israel should nuke Gaza was shocking, actually, uh, really shocking. And Netanyahu is right, quite right to suspend him. Of course, what uh, Eliyahu does is to reveal bluntly the dark side of the extreme right wing of Netanyahu's cabinet. Now, Netanyahu is not somebody I warm to at all, but there are far worse voices in the Israeli government machine, uh, in the power base of modern Israel. And these people, of course, are, the, are those who write these extraordinary documents which... Um, recapture and invert the slogan from the river to the sea, uh, which are clearly out to um, erase Gaza, to subject or uh, to, to, to get rid of the West Bank and so on. Those aren't the voices of modern Israel, I hope. And it is in a sense, quite a positive to hear this voice from Eliyahu and to witness Netanyahu's very clear and very direct um, decision. So Netanyahu has said that Eliyahu would be suspended from cabinet meetings indefinitely and uh but 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 in a way that doesn't that doesn't mean anything because in the context of a war there are barely any cabinet meetings anyway but it is a it is a statement that Eliyahu is on the outside that Israel has no intentions of using nuclear weapons against Gaza and that this is a form of extremism which is now identified firmly and rejected. This hasn't stopped protests in Jerusalem against Netanyahu, and it hasn't stopped protesters being clamped down on by the police. And it hasn't stopped other people outside the Israeli cabinet, other extremists like um, Ramben Barak, um, who was at one point the director of Mossad, suggesting that Gazans are split up and sent to a hundred different countries, better in Canada than in Gaza. So let us distribute Gazans all over the world. Uh, I'm, I'm sure we're going to hear plenty of these arguments because the right wing, the extremists, are very vocal and very powerful in Israel, and if we think that Netanyahu is a right-wing extremist, I'm afraid I do, there are worse. There are worse, and we shouldn't be surprised about that.